Gotcha. What, does, what does success look like for you? I mean, like, you know, you're going through the 757 Startup Studios program. I'm not sure how long that is, but like, what does success look like after that? And overall, like, what does success look like to you? Um, for me, when the, when the product is really adapted um, and get into like approved by the market and started paying like 10K MRR, then I would think it's a success. And I'm really shooting for 10K MRR is my target and I sleep with it. I think about it, how to get 10,000, how to get to the point where I get 10K MRR per month. And and, and of that 10K, I mean, do you have a, a, a timeline on how to do that, right? So I, I feel, so just, just me, uh, giving advice here, right? So like from a goal perspective, a lot of people will say, oh, I want to get to 10K MMR, MR, or 10, 10K, 100K, 120K AR, or whatever it is, right? Is there a time frame involved in that? Yes, is, is, yeah. six months. Okay. That's, that's part of my pitch deck too. Like what I ask is for, you know, six months and then I would want to, you know, make at least 10K MRR, then I know it's a success. Um, Rick, yeah, a recurring 10K MRR is what I think. Because when it comes to 10K, if I made from zero to 10, I do not think it would be hard to go from 10K to 100 or 200 to a million because you have then resources available to you. To get to the 10, first 10K is extremely hard, is, is very hard, is what I think. Well, that's your first 100 customers too, right? So if you can get 100 customers. That is customers, correct. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And once you break the shell and you know that it's working and it's bringing you some money, then you know it's working. There's a process that's working. You just got to put more into the process and expand markets or bring more resources to make that happen. And it could happen. But they're getting that 10K MRR because now I can't hire a sales guy without paying them, right? On equity, you've got to be on equity. And I have a CTO and I have a CMO. I'm really happy uh, that they are on with me. Uh, but I need a really sales guy too. But like they say, there is no better salesperson than the CEO itself for the first okay. few customers. Totally and I believe in that. Yeah. So I'm gonna. I'm the person that's gonna have to make it happen. No one's gonna love car happy like Nick. Right. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> how how can we help you get to uh, to, to 10k in monthly recurring revenue? I appreciate any connections that you can with my employers. Just an interview uh, would be great. You know, my target market is employers between China in the area, like whether it's a Virginia Beach, Hampton Roads area, but more focusing on Norfolk because I can get to the providers pretty easily in Norfolk. Uh, yeah, any connections you can make happen for an interview would be great. As someone who's been directly involved within the startup community for almost a decade, I want to talk to you about a serious pain point, spending a ton of time trying to understand the business landscape in the 757. That's time that should be focused on growing the business. At Startwheel, we're here to help you by compiling all of the news you need to know about in one place. Now there's no need to search multiple websites. Just head to startwheel.org and see for yourself. That's startwheel.org.